Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Joe. So, sorry, you guys all had you guys all had to get up early. And uh, get up early. Joe, get up early. Oh, early so it's nice to be here. This is my first Let's Get to Work day. And uh, as you know, uh, the first business I ever purchased was a uh, donut shop, uh, so my mom could have a uh, wife that I worked there. We were both still in college, and uh, I just got down to Navy. Still in college, working full time in different jobs at the grocery stores. But we got to work in a, in a donut shop just like this, uh, and uh, we. Uh, it was fun. Uh, the people who work in the donut shops were really nice people. We sold a lot of donuts. Well, the price is a little bit different. Back then it was $1.49 a dozen. The funniest thing that the, uh, the franchisor said, because you're trying to get sales up, you know, we tripled the sales the first month, but he said, if you pass out 8,000, uh, you you bought 50 cents off, uh, that you'll get a 30% return. So I walked door to door at thousand places, I got 50 percent And he said, oh, did you put an expiration date? So the first lesson I learned is, on all coupons, there needs to be an expiration date. You did that last night? No, that's what I did when I backed my head. This morning, it's important for you to be doing this. Why? Well, I think we've got to continue to highlight uh, what we're doing, and say getting everybody back to work. I think we have, we have to highlight all the, uh, the businesses in the state. Uh, the, uh, every business is important. Uh, so Rachel, who owns uh, Nicola's, uh, has a lot of employees here. They're they're very dependent on the, the economy, and uh, that's why today we sell out all these donuts. Everybody comes in by the donut. Uh, I imagine uh, doing this job that you did so many years ago brought back some memories. Good and bad. Always fun. The uh, I uh, I got to this morning. I got to make. Uh, 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 I got to cook the donuts. It was the same technology as back then. And uh, the we got to you know you, you push out the uh, uh, the flour or the uh, uh, dough to make the uh, glaze. That's what I like the most. Uh, you know, make sure there's you know, they're uh, uh, the best when right when they're out of the. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry, the glaze is really good. What's the toughest part of making donuts? The toughest part of making donuts is don't overcook them. Don't overproof them. Uh, the, uh, that's probably the hardest part of making donuts. Governor, what do you hope to learn? What do you hope to show by doing this? I think I think that to highlight uh, you know the importance of every business, uh, large and small in the state. And uh, you know you you look at this and you look at the individuals here. Rachel that owns it. How hardworking they are. I mean, they work. They come in early. Um, they work the tail off. That's sort of the Ameri That's the American dream. Uh, the owner here came from the Philippines. Um, I think she's been here 12 years, and that's America. You know, people come to this country. Uh, they get to build their lives, build their American dreams. So that's what that's what this state is about. Obviously, helps as far as a PR aspect, getting out amongst the people. You're doing this for a reason, as far as that's concerned, as well. Well, you know, the best the best part about this job, you know, a lot of people ask if you like running for governor. I loved running for governor because I don't know if I met 50,000, 100,000 people. But the best part of this job is just getting out and talking to people, and you get ideas. Like an individual walked up to me a little while ago with a with an idea of a thousand jobs. And uh, so I'll, I'll read it. So you get the more you get out and talk to people, you get their ideas, things you ought to one things you ought to focus on. And I know the biggest things for our state are education for kids. Um, we got to make sure that people have the opportunity for a job. Uh, so and the uh, the positive is, you know, unemployment's come down this year from 12 percent to 10.6. Uh, we've generated 85,000 jobs this year. The negative is we still have 900,000 people without without a job in the state. So. Uh, but you get ideas every place you go. Did you contact Bob Grant? Let him know you get your opinion back now. Yeah, yeah. What did yeah. he say to you? Uh, well, he was very complimentary. Uh, you know, it, he, it was a way for him to let people know how much he cared and uh, get ideas. And so he was, you know, he was very gracious. So it's, it's nice that when he started this, we should have. Everybody should be doing this. It's fun. Plus, you get to meet a lot of interesting people. Why weren't you doing this earlier? Why is this, uh, you know, taking this long into your uh, into your term to start doing this? I know I should have. Uh, the uh, you know it's, it is a whirlwind when you uh, become governor. The you know the, you've got to have a budget in 30 days, and then the session starts 30 days later, and you have to hire uh, all these individuals, and you have I think I have like 2,000 appointments. So it's how fast you can do everything you do, that you do. I wish I, I wish everything I, I'd like to do I did you know, day one, but it's hard to do. it's awfully hard to do that. Is this always a priority to get back amongst the people? People and have some vehicle to do this. This is, this is the best part of the job. Now, if you don't like people, you shouldn't be governor. 
But if you like people uh, and you want to get out and talk to people, this is the best job. You can't imagine a better job than being governor. Plus, this is the, this is the state to be governor because this is the state that people want to live in. If you go, if you travel this country, travel the world, everybody knows about Florida. People want to live in Florida. They want to work in Florida. So we just got to create the environment where uh, where everybody has the opportunity to build their business here, start their job, you know, companies here, get a job here. So this is this is this is Rachel. She's got uh, so she uh, she came here 12 years ago. Yeah. 12 years years ago for the Philippines, and so she's built an unbelievable business here, and she has great uh, donuts. Uh, my favorite is the glaze, or if I'm not glaze, it's the chocolate cup glaze. Yeah. Uh, so, but all their donuts are good. I guess so are these maple. Yeah, some are maple, and then these are the double chocolate. But yeah. I was just going to say, um, really? we need to trail some of these things. Claire, if you can go back to work. I need to make work. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that uh, was thanks good. for coming. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Wow. You need to get back to work. Sounds like our news director. All right. She's a slave driver. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, time to make the donuts. Let's go cut one of these up and uh, make some tea. Thank you very much. I appreciate your uh, hand falling asleep on you. Good job, Grace.